back to my channel so today i'm gonna be doing a vlogmas for the very first time like ever and i'm super super pumped so if you like this video go ahead and give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you are new here i am meaty did i already say that i'm not sure but it is friday um december 4th i don't work on fridays and i'm super pumped about that and i'm gonna take you guys on my day we are gonna be doing a lot of stuff but first i have to eat because i'm super hungry um, and when is the last time I even ate? Um, it was a long time ago. Okay, so let's go ahead and eat. <music> guys so here is our breakfast i'm so excited we have protein um, banana pancakes with strawberries and leche la lechera which is what i always use orange juice and um we also have some uh, grapefruit so so excited to eat this i'll catch you guys later okay guys so i am done eating and i didn't want to eat too much because i'm going to the gym here in a bit but before i go to the gym I'm sorry for my heater. I don't know if you guys could hear it, but it's really loud. But anyway, before I go to the gym, I did want to make a to-do list because I have a lot of things to do today. Usually I do a to-do list on my phone, but I remembered to bring my iPad um, over the weekend this week. So um, I'm just going to do it on here. I like to use Notability because it is so perfect. I literally use it like all day for teaching I just keep notes there and so that's what I'm gonna do I have a bunch of things to do and this is probably gonna be like a um, two or three day like to-do list like it's gonna take me that long to accomplish these things writing down a to-do list is seriously so helpful for me and I don't do it enough I feel like I should do a, make a to-do list every single day especially with teaching but it's so helpful I think I need to be more mindful of like um, how I'm spending my time and, and when I do to-do lists I tend to get more um, stuff done because I know I have to accomplish something and I can focus on like scratching something off whenever I finish it so super nice oh Christmas tree oh Christmas tree been wondering just what you mean to me oh Christmas tree Okay guys, so I already finished my to-do list and it's nothing like super crazy, but um, it is going to take a lot of time and I am hopefully going to get all of these done by this weekend, hopefully, wish me luck, but um, yeah, so this is what it looks like, nothing fancy, um, I did um, write it with my Apple Pencil and I'm honestly not very good with my Apple Pencil, so my handwriting is a little sloppy, but this is, these are my, um, the things that need to get done this weekend right now i am gonna get ready to go to the gym because i told a lady that i do crossfit with that i was gonna work out with her and honestly i don't feel like going to the gym but the fact that i told her um just like i want to keep my word you know so i want to go and um i've only worked out three times this week anyway so i do need to go to the gym but i'm like cozy and warm and it's really cold outside so i guess Let's go ahead and go. <laughs> Do you guys hate it when there's like no motivation whatsoever to go to the gym? But then I love it because you get there, you get to the gym, and then you do your workout, and then you feel so much better about yourself. So hopefully that's the case. Honestly, it's never been much about you. Don't get me wrong, I think you're great. Root of tradition, we. Okay guys, so I made it back from the gym, I took a shower, I even got ready because we're gonna go to a friend's house um, to make some Christmas wreaths here later on. So yes, that's that. That was a huge accomplishment by the way because um, I went to the gym and we did this workout with the lady that I told you guys about. We did this workout where we had a deck of cards and each suit stood for um, a workout. So for example, um, spades or like a diamond was sit-ups, spades were pull-ups and things like that. So we had four different workouts and we had to finish the deck. So we had to turn each card around and whenever we turn a card around, like for example, if it was a uh, four of 
diamonds we had to do four pull-ups if 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 it was a um 10 of spades we had to do 10 sit-ups and so it was kind of crazy and i love that workout so i'm gonna post it here somewhere so that you guys can see it and you guys can do it it took us almost an hour and it was such a good workout so yeah i loved it and the lady that i worked out with is like literally insane she ran half a mile before we started and then i left and she was running again so and she's in like her 50s so literally goals but anyway guys um right now i need to get my life um straightened up i need to clean my room because it's a huge mess and i haven't even done my bed um so yeah let's go ahead and do that now i am gonna set a timer for 20 minutes on my to see how much I can get done because if I don't set a timer I'm just gonna work on my own um, time and I don't like that so let's go ahead and clean all right I know I'm procrastinating but before we get started cleaning um, I wanted to show you guys my outfit so here it is um, the white shirt is from Target I only paid five dollars for it which was awesome this one is also from Target I paid twenty dollars for it so a little bit more expensive but it's such an awesome staple piece and it covers the back so that's perfect the leggings are from Fabletics. I just recently got some Fabletics leggings from Marcos as my early Christmas gift. So I was really excited because I love Fabletics. And um, I'm also wearing some combat boots. These combat boots are literally amazing. I only paid $20 for them and they are from Belk. So I'm going to try to link them down below. I'm not sure if they're $20 still because I got them for uh, Black Friday. But I'm going to try to link them down below. They are so comfy and I can't believe I paid $20 for them. What? Okay, let's go ahead and clean. More than anything, it's all the people. so I am making some good progress but right now um, I am trying to figure out this map or where to put this map I think I want it more that way so I'm gonna drill some holes and take some of those nails out because I don't need them anymore but you guys this map is from Mapiful. Mapiful actually sent it to me thank you so much I love it it is so beautiful you guys so it's a map that I customize on their website super simple to do it you can pick the size that you want your map to be and you can also pick a location and the coordinates so I picked Chihuahua Mexico because that's where I am from it looks so beautiful but right now I am just trying to fix it so I will let you guys know um, how it turns out but guys if I were you I would go ahead and check out their website because they have so many more beautiful maps and I will have that link down below for you guys so that you guys can go check them out don't get me wrong you're a sight to see with all faded photos of family all right so i think i got it figured out i went ahead and moved it this way but now the this side of the wall looks a little empty i do have to um, dab some holes and figure this emptiness out or maybe i'll just leave it like that but i think i really like it this way i did end up taking this wall decor down because i thought it looked a little bit tacky with the map but i am trying to find a new place for them because they are beautiful um this is actually handmade by my friend she custom made it for me and she is so so good at macrame so i'm gonna have her uh handle of instagram down below so that you guys can check her out and order some macrame from her she just started her own little business not too long ago and she is so talented she also makes keychains coasters like literally anything you want she will make for you and this one i'm not sure what i'm gonna do with it but i, I like it all of these pictures i took and they all mean so much to me i love the mountains i love the sunsets i love traveling and i really like the city lights and photography in general so i definitely want this um to stay in my room but i just don't know where 
So let's find a place for it. Hey guys, what's up? So I made it back home. Um, we went to our friend's house and we made some wreaths. So I wanted to show you guys. By the way, I'm sorry that I abandoned you. It's just that we needed some girl time and I didn't want to take my camera because some people just don't like to be um, vlogged, you know? So I totally respect that. Um, but yeah, we made some wreaths and then my friend gave me this super cute mug with um, coffee beans that are like chocolate covered coffee beans. So yummy and a Christmas card. So that was really sweet. It was nice to catch up. Um, we are both really busy or not both, but all of us are really busy. So it was nice to have some girl time. But yeah, we made it back. It is late. I am about to go to sleep. Also, I did want to be clear on this that I am doing Vlogmas, but I can't upload every single day for you guys because I am a full-time teacher and I'm pretty busy um, throughout the week. So I'm going to try to post as many times as I can throughout the week, probably two videos per week, hopefully. Um, but yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I enjoyed taking you guys along with me on my day and it wasn't like super exciting or anything, nothing over the top, but I hope that you guys um, like these types of videos. Please stay tuned for many more videos to come. I asked you guys on Instagram for ideas on like other videos that you guys want to see during Vlogmas and you guys gave me so many ideas. I literally got like over a hundred ideas for me to do for Vlogmas and I seriously appreciate that so much. Thank you guys for your feedback. I'm gonna try to come through on all of the content that you guys want to see because I want to make you guys happy and you guys deserve it because you guys are awesome and you guys are always supporting me and I really appreciate that. So anyway, I will see you guys tomorrow. I will vlog again tomorrow. Have a good night if it is nighttime for you. I love you guys so much and God bless you. Bye.